Hi, welcome to my page. My name is Alicia Darlene. I'm a first time mom and I want to just congratulate you on starting this new mom journey because chances are if you are watching this video, you are pregnant, so congratulations. Pregnancy is the happiest reason for feeling like crap. I'll be going over weeks, um, starting now, six weeks until 40 on my channel, so feel free to watch every single week for updates on how you and baby are both growing and changing. So you can skip ahead to whatever week you're currently at, or you can binge watch all the way until where you are right now just to see how far you and baby have come along okay so let's get started so we're first going to talk about baby how baby is changing and growing and then we're going to talk about mom also don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel you can also turn on the notification bell on the side and that'll just give you a notifications every time i upload a video at the end of this video i'm also going to talk a little bit about how I'm able to stay home and make a full income from home. And don't worry, it's not an MLM or a pyramid scheme. So if you want to hear about that, that's going to be at the end of the video. Okay, so let's get started. So six weeks, you just found out that you are pregnant. Your baby is about the size of a lentil or about a fourth inch. So pretty tiny. Your baby's heart has started beating about 160 times per minute. It's almost twice as fast as yours. You'll get to see it in your next or in your first ultrasound, which is going to be about eight weeks and you'll be able to hear it with the Doppler between like 10 and 12 weeks. So there's going to be some dark spots on your baby's head right now where the nostrils and the eyes are getting created or starting to form. Emerging ears are going to be on the side of the head. The baby's tongue and vocal cords are also starting to develop already at six weeks. Your baby's arms and legs just look like little paddles but they're there and the backbone will extend into a small tail but that'll disappear in a couple of weeks. Okay, so now to talk about mamas. It's completely normal not to have any type of symptoms, but for most, um, you'll get those early pregnancy symptoms starting now, this week. So most of you might be getting morning sickness or um, you'll get it the next couple of weeks. The definition of morning sickness is just nausea when you're pregnant the, for the first couple of months. And despite its name of morning sickness, you can get it throughout any type of the, any time of the day. But this should ease up by the end of the first semester. I remember I would get morning sickness sometimes right when I would wake up and I get out of bed, I would feel nauseated. But then sometimes right before dinner or after dinner, I would also feel nauseated. So it kind of just hits you at different times of the day, like I said. I had really bad morning sickness the entire first semester, so the first three months. But then once I hit my second semester, it kind of eased up and I wasn't as bad as I was. So you can do things to help reduce more morning sickness like I would eat Cheerios right thing in the morning you can do crackers anything kind of bland ginger also helped me a lot so I would do like the fresh ginger or the ginger candies you can kind of find what works for you and peppermint gum anything like that um, even if you wanted to do peppermint um, essential oils so anything like that that helps you go for it and totally stay away from things that want that make you want to vomit I remember just the smell of like ground beef cooking would make me super sick or just the thought of eating any vegetables. I don't know why I eat vegetables a lot, but just during that first trimester, it would just make me sick. So I definitely just kind of did like a veggie drink instead because I wasn't really wanting to eat that. So just whatever works for you. Like I said, just go for that because it's kind of weird how it messes with you for the first trimester. You can watch my video on the quick and easy tips to get rid of morning sickness. I'll leave that in the description below if that's something you wanna look uh, more into. So needing the, to pee more is definitely the most common pregnancy symptom right now. And are you moody? Cause that's totally normal also. You have stress, fatigue, and hormonal changes to think for that. Breast tenderness can also be um, a very early sign that you are pregnant. So increased hormone levels and blood flow make your breasts feel sensitive, tingly, and swollen. And many women also feel exhaustion at the beginning. And it's kind of hard sometimes when moms are super busy and they're always on the go why you feel tired, but it's completely okay to feel tired. Your body is about to make a baby. So resting when you need to is okay. Eating well, especially making sure that you're eating enough folate to help um, prevent any birth defects. Start taking a prenatal pill if you haven't already. And just definitely know which foods and beverages do you wanna stay away from. I also made a video on that. I will link that in the description below if you wanna look more 
into what kind of foods and drinks you should be avoiding. So that's pretty much it for week six and I want to congratulate you on this new mama journey. Like I said, I'm going to be making weeks six through 40. So if you want to just follow along with whatever week that you're on, be sure to like and subscribe to my channel. And like I said, hit the notification bell to get updates on every time I come out with a new video. And if you're anything like me, where you want to stay home with your baby, you don't want to just go off to work or leave baby at the daycare, you want to be able to make passive income from home, be your own boss. So if you want to learn more how I was able to leave a job and just completely stay home, I will leave that link in the, the I'll leave that first link in the description below how I was kind of able to start my own li online business and how that we can help you start your online business so you don't have to go back to work either so me and my team would love to mentor you so just click that link below and let me know if you have any questions and I will see you next week